Hello there guys, and welcome back to my Scum single player series. Now, it's been a little while, but I have been very busy. Because, as you can see, I've put down a flag. We're in the location where I wanted to build, and I've built something spectacular. Look, we even have a kennel for a dog, if we find a dog. Give him some food. I've built a box with windows and a door. So yeah, basically, this is what I've been busy doing. It's a 3x3, three three, just a box, basically. Obviously, it's not finished because, you know, it's going to get a bit wet, but it's a box with a garage that was just here. And also... Uh, we've got this little shed, but what is um, cool, so what I wanted to show you, is that there was a bike here as well, so we have a bike back, which is quite cool, and got a few logs and things in there ready to go, but I wanted to build some storage containers. Uh, why is that showing 400? That shouldn't be there. Those units were against this wall. Yeah, see? I don't know what's happened there, but we'll redo that. Uh, where are they? Ba -ba -ba -ba, there. Because they were here. Where they were. But one there. One there. One. Wait, stay there. Come on. Come on. There. And then one more for luck. One. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. There we go. There we go. Four of those. But what I need is the metal. I have got zero scrap metal. Also, there should be roofs here. I mean, the, the, the blueprint of the roof. No, oh, wrong one. It's a building, isn't it? A ramp, a roof. Yeah, see? That was already along, and I'll finish this off. I've got all materials to do those things, but I need the metal. So yeah, this is it, basically. And my bed should be, yeah, in here. There we go. Because this one has an oven and a big fridge. So hopefully we can use this as our main sort of living quarter, I suppose. And this is just the storage. That's why it's just a box. I didn't go too crazy. It's just a box with a garage, but a wall at the back. Block this off. And there's a door here. And also because... Okay, I just decided to lie down on the stairs. Because it's small... It's also fairly easy to upgrade as well, so uh, we'll try and do that at some point. But it is really going to pee down. But, today's task is to go to the junkyard. Because we need scrap. And there's a petrol station on the way, which is fine, because we also need fuel. But first of all, well no, first of all we need the fuel. Yeah. Second of all, we need the scrap. And the best place to get the scrap from is the junkyard. So that's where we're going to go. To the scrap heap. Uh oh. There we go. To the scrap heap we go. Or to the petrol station first. Or the gas station. Whoop. As they call it. Yes, there we go. Heading in the right direction. Oh, it got very dark all of a sudden. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Uh, I better keep that open because I need to see how much fuel we've got left. Also, whilst building that box, uh, there was an airdrop that I did go and get, and it had a pistol suppressor in it. So we now have a suppressor for the pistol. But not for anything else, unfortunately. Only for the pistol. Ooh, barrier, barrier. 
Right, this is our first port of call. Just need to, uh, you know... There we go, look, see? Got a suppressor on it. You can just see. This is our first port of call. 19 of 19, this is why we love the HSF-19. Oh, hello. Right. One down. You, I'm not so worried about. I'm worried about the hee hee ha ha. Where is Mr. Hee hee ha ha? One down. I can hear Mr. Hee Hee. What a shot. I missed. Mr. Hee Hee. There's Mr. Hee Hee. There you go. That's him down. What was on her head? Did you see that? She looked like a clicker out of The Last of Us. Now that is what I call... A good... Oh, it's another one. Where is he? That is what I call a good execution of puppets. Silently, no one was triggered, no one came running at me, stealth, controlled shots, I spoke too soon, they came running at me, or one did anyway. Alright, where's the other Mr. Hee Hee Ha Ha? Come on, hee hee ha ha, where are you? Actually, not a lot of fuel here. Uh... Oh, look at that, medium handgun skills. Uh-oh. Wow, so... There we go. That took care of him. And we should be... No, we're not. I see you there in the bush. <sighs> Thinks I didn't see her, but I did. I saw you. Anybody home? Nobody home. Okay. Yes, that is what I call a good execution. Oh, another one of those. Quite handy there. Uh, check behind that counter. Check for any Munley. No Munley. That's a shame. No oh, brake fluid. Ooh, batteries. Very important. Uh, don't think I've ever actually used the wrench pipe. To be honest. Right. Yeah, it's got a few. And there's another bike there, look. Right, let's go and get the car. Fill it up. And continue on with our journey. Ah, I've just realized I brought my arrows, but I didn't bring my bow. That's okay. Wow, that got damaged. Hang on. Some stuff I don't need here. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. That can be reloaded. Might as well get an extra mag. I've got quite a few 9 mil, and I've got the, obviously, the ump from last time. And I don't need those two either. Alright, don't need you, don't need you, therefore I don't need you. There we go. Right. All good in the hood. Let's just get that one reloaded as well whilst we're here. That one's actually only at 52%, so it may cause some blockages. Or some jams, rather. And speaking of guns, hopefully, very soon, we should get the new SKS. 
And also, I've noticed it's gone very quiet on the scar front. There was a few images released a little while back. Or quite a while back now, actually. Ooh, they've all despawned. Please don't respawn. But there was a few images released a little while back regarding the, um... 643! Damn. Also, you can see, I'm very close to unlocking a few items to be able to purchase from the trader. Almost at 120 fame points. But obviously you need a lot more than that. Is this full? Oh, I didn't bring it. There's my bow. Oh well. We'll go no bow. No bow hobo. We can do. Take that. And fill this up as well. For 174. Damn. This shit ain't cheap. Right. Now. No, we don't push. We drive. We have fuel now. We can drive. Drive. And I have to say, without the front bumper, this thing looks kind of beasty. Look at that. Looks a lot cooler without the front and back bumpers. I should get some doors, really. Right, now I'm going the wrong way. Now we go to the scrapyard. Oh, my bike should still be here, actually. I should really come back and get this. Should be. There it is. My little buddy. Yeah, regarding the scar, there actually hasn't been that much news on it. It's gone very quiet. They sort of released the image of the scar quite a while ago. And then there was a few other follow-up images. And ever since that, it's gone very quiet. So I don't quite know what's happening with that yet. Nothing has really been said or done or anything. And then they all of a sudden released the information about the SKS. So maybe we're going to get the scar and the SKS at the same time. That would be nice. That's a tree. That's a bush. Yeah, because I do think... They need some more weapons. Um, I know they introduced the grenade launcher not so long ago, but the um, thing is I've been playing a lot of DayZ recently, and I've actually found a really cool online server. Uh, so I'm going to start doing some Day DayZ videos as well, because I do like DayZ. I've always liked DayZ. I mean, I've been playing DayZ since before I've been playing Scum, but not as hardcore as Scum. I've been playing Scum a lot more... Please don't fall in the water. A lot more hardcore than um, DayZ. But I do like DayZ, I have to say. It has got its own elements that I really like. Just like Scum does. But, yeah... The thing with DayZ is that there are so many mods now that basically it's a completely different game to the standalone version. I mean, it's it's completely different. It really is. And I like it, so. And as long as you like it and you enjoy it, you may as well play it, right? If you didn't like it, don't play it. But yes, I, do, I, I still think that Scum should introduce some more weapons. And I'm sure they're going to. I'm sure they're going to. But um, also, of course, when they release Scum fully, if they allow modding, which I think they will, I remember listening to in one of the Q&As that they did on Rakit's stream, with Tomislav and the guys that, you know, modders will be able to step in and do what they want, so then then it will be, again, a completely different game. It will be something utterly, well, in my opinion, amazing, but, you know, each to their own. So, but, rock! Again, that is a little bit a way off. I mean, we are on Point nine. I don't know if there's going to be a point five. I'm assuming there's going to be a point five before 
version 1, and I think it's version 1 that they want to go to uh, full release with. Go this way. Because this up here is a bunker, the sort of headphones looking thing. Yeah, they want to go to full release, so out of early access, are, are with version 1. And we're at version 9 already, so, you know, maybe within a year... Maybe within a year, we might be on full release. And then it will be interesting. Then it will be interesting. And I do hope the modders pick it up, because, you know... Having... Whoa, that was a bit jerky. I think, no, I don't want to go to the bunker. I run to the wrong way. Having the modding community. I mean, some of the mods are amazing, man. What people can mod these days. I mean, I'm way too stupid for that stuff. That, that's that's in-depth. Where the hell am I going? That's real in-depth stuff that I'm just too stupid for. No, I wouldn't even know where to begin to do something like that. Oh dear. So, um... The modding I will leave to the professionals, basically. But yeah, some of them do look amazing. Some of the mods out there that you can get for different games. So just think, you know... You could be driving around scum in a Lamborghini. Why you'd be doing that, I don't know, but you could be. In the future. Right, now I want to follow the road. And I hope this is the right place. I haven't been to the scrapyard in a while, but I'm pretty sure this is the right place. Oh, driving basic. There we go, look at that. Two things in one day. Driving and handgun. How nice. Uh, yes, I believe this is the scrapyard. Yes, I do believe this is a scrapyard. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh oh, they're all spawning in. Back it up. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Come on, out you get. There we go, come on then. Oh, let's see, they're so stupid. One. Two. You die. Thank you. This is what we came for. Metal. Lots of metal. Are you dead? You're dead. Right, what I will do is quickly just empty. I'll leave the car here, it's safer. Is I'll just rank all this stuff in here. So we've got a full, a full, not a full, an empty backpack. This is all the goodies that we want. Lots of metal. Lots of metal. So you imagine those things could be modded. You imagine driving around in one of them. Or the big trucks. You know, the big... Um, dumper trucks and bulldozers and things. That would be so cool. What a shot. What a shot. Oh, look at that. I am being a Hawkeye today. Or more of a John Wick, actually. Parking sensor I don't want. I beg your pardon. Where did you come from? Uh, no, don't need any of that. Oh, this is just one lump. Okay. Nails I don't need. Yeah, let's see. Imagine driving around one of these. That would be so cool. Mobile phone I'll take. They're good to be sold. That would be so cool. Uh-oh. 
Back it up. Shoot her in the neck. Down for the count. Right. Continue on the metal hunt. Just literally going to fill up the backpack. Drop it off and go and get some more. Because metal is quite a needed commodity in this game when it comes to crafting. Why won't you die? Thank you. Let's just get the high ground. So we can see. Yes, all of this scrap. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh, that was my bad. That was a miss on my behalf. Uh-oh. You're stuck. Oh! I'm out. I'm stuck on the metal. Run! Bloody. Super quick flash zombie puppet things. Okay. Right. I need a little reload here. Uno momento. I could switch to the ump. Uh... Oh dear, I have no 9 mil. Okay, so we're switching to the ump. My white ump. That's a point. Was that still white? Yes, it was. This will attract everybody, though. Let me just double check. This is loaded. Yes, it is. Okay. All right. I'm assuming a lot of them. Yeah, there you go. Let's see. Okay, that was a bad idea. Run! That was a bad idea. Woo! Ooh. And breathe. I knew that would attract all of them. Literally just lining up. Oh. You were trying to be sneaky. Right. Once we're here, we may as well dump this in the car. Woo. Not the magazine. They really need a select all kind of function, drag and drop. Because I don't know why my character keeps bending over like he's going to vomit. Maybe he's busting for a wee? Come on, in you get all of you. Right, I think we can go in a bit closer. No, I don't want to push. Why do you keep pushing? Stop pushing. Drive. I have fuel. There we go. Right. This will attract them. But we can just run them down. Ooh. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. My game crashed. But we're back in. Uh, I actually had to run the integrity. And we've still got all our stuff, which is good. So I don't know what happened there. But yeah, we're back again. And luckily, I didn't lose anything. So we can get back to scrapping. Because scrapping is good. You need all the scrap. Let me just check that I have some bullets in my gun. Yes, I do. Oh, look, I never noticed that before. Look, that actually sways in the wind. 
See, it's the little things, man. It really is the little things. Little things that have a big impact. That's what we like. That's what we like. Right. See, these are the things I was talking about earlier. I've been driving around in one of these. The awesome plowing through puppets. Uh, I think that crash has caused some kind of interference. Oh no, they are spawning in. There you go, he's over there, look. They are spawning in. Right, I'm going to check out this hangar. Oh, there's a, there's a Volkswagen over there, look. I've got two wheels for you. Got no doors. Certainly on this side it's got no doors. Go and see if it's got a henge in. Does it have a henge in? Uh, well, it's missing one wheel. And a driver's seat. And it's got no engine. Okay. So we don't need you. Be bricks. Yes. Lots and lots of bricks. I'm not at the brick stage yet. I'm currently at the metal and wood stage still. Nobody home? No. See, I want to drive this. Drive the forklift. Forklift? Forklift. Lift. And tuna. Uh, oh, a tire repair kit. Okay, I can sell it. Uh, a small axe. I can take it. Nothing else in here? Yep, some more tuna. Not that I particularly like fish. Open on that puppet that was aggroed. Oh, what's that? Sea salt. Well, this is cozy, isn't it? You could actually have this as a base if you wanted to. Oh, you've got a light switch, you've got a window, bunk bed, table, you know, set up a gaming PC on there, cooker. You just uh, have to do your business like an animal in the bushes, that's all. Whoa. Where are you? Ah! Oh, well, here we go again. Oh, shit. Here we go again. Look at them all. They're everywhere. In the leg and in the head. That is the best approach. Slow them down. And take them out. Right. Back to the car and move further forward. There's another puppet over there. Might as well go and check this out whilst we're here. Also fill up on the scrap. This is the main entrance, I do believe. Hello. Hello. There you go. Oh, look, you could actually have quite a few bases here. I missed. I know I missed. I missed again. Didn't miss that time, though. I'm feeling pretty hot. What is that? Yoga leggings. No, thank you. Right, let's just... Oh, I've still got two magazines left. That are fully loaded. 
That is a little pink backpack. Oh, let's see. This one's not so good. It doesn't have a fridge in it. There's something up there. What is it? Jeans. Nah, I want jeans. Uh, let me out, please, game. Thank you. And what is that? That is vegetable oil. We need all of these goodies for cooking. Oh, there you are. Got him by surprise. Normally good things in these containers. Not containers. Offices. If you can call it that. There is one. Somewhere. I don't know where. Right. Let's go and dump this back in and move further forward. Because my backpack is getting a wee bit heavy now. A wee bit on the heavy side. Soon we will get these. So soon they will be back to us. I hope. I really hope. So, so soon. And yoink, 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 yoink. See, this is where another backpack would be. Would come in handy. But I've only actually found this one hiking backpack. And I think I found one more in one of the bunkers. The, 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 the huts that we did. In the... Oh, dear, oh, dear. In the barracks. Right. Get all of that in there. Put that in there. Get that. Put that. Put that back there. Right. No, I don't want to push. No, 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 no. Cancel. No. No. It's going to run away from me. Drive. Why push? Drive. Onward. Onward! Preferably without destroying my vehicle. Yes, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, another bike! Boxes. Boxes are good. Be quick, be quick, be quick. Boxes are good. Alright, let's just funnel them through this gate. Here they come. Arr, 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 arr. There they go. Oh, I do like the UMP. It only had a suppressor. It would be so much better. There's some shells there. One thing I don't currently need is uh, shotgun shells. I'm rather okay with those. I have to be honest. Scrappy, scrappy, scrappy. These things. See? Imagine driving around in these. Collecting all your resources. It would be awesome. Oh, look, a 40 u screwdriver. Hello. That's a good find. That's a very good find. Yeah, that's just a single one. Nothing in there. May as well check out these ones and go into the orifices. And then I think there's a wheel for my Leica. That is a strange place to find a wheel. But I am not going to refuse it. Ah, I forgot about this little military bit here. Yes. Yes, I forgot about this. Look at that. Combat, combat helmet. Orange and juice, nine mil for my silenced pistol, an MRE. This is a good little some chocolate. This is a good little stash. 
and a hunter. And what we can do, unpack that, and reload one of these. I already get one and a half. I forgot about this little bit. I'm glad I came here. I'm glad I came here. No, no, no. You go into there, and then we might as well reload you. And then I can go back to being silenced, but deadly. Come on. Three, two, one, and you're done. Give it a reload. There we go. Actually, that's still got some ammo in it, so we may as well top that one off. It's all about being prepared. Because if you go into these things unprepared, you are a dead lady or man. You're a dead person. Put it that way. You're a dead person. But I think in terms of the boxes, that is it. That's okay, because we can head back and I can put together the, um, the thing. Oh, look, see, box of bolts. Nails, rather, sorry. I did meze, I did meze? No, I didn't meze, I missed these two. I can't speak today for some reason. I have forgotten how to speak. Uh, some more of those, they can be sold. I need to move my wheel down. There we go. That can be sold. Or the good old Wonga. Right. In we go. Get him out the way. Sleeping on the job again, are we? Terrible. Terrible. This is a good sniping spot. Look at this. Look at this. I wish the sun would come out, though. I'd like to see some sun and another box of bolts. Well, we've got a lot of building to do, so... We have three screwdriver. I'll take you. Thank you. It's empty. Very good. Always worth checking these little boxes, because this is where you get the screwdrivers from. with that. That was a watering can, though. Handy. Ooh, a rebuild cutter. Ooh, I have no space. Oh, damn. Oh, damn, oh, damn. Ah, <laughs> I have no space. Because of the wheel. Do you fit now? Oh, because you're exactly five kilos. Um... So, there you go. Now you're fit. That is a toolbox. God damn it. You need toolboxes, actually. There you go. Uh, more nails. Might as well. Might as well. Soap. Pickaxe. Oh, uh, paper. Lots of paper, look. I wish one thing you could do in this game is write notes. Oh, spray can. What colour? Flat brown. Yeah. That doesn't seem too appealing, does it? Ooh. Brown. But I suppose for the camouflage effect. I think we're pretty full now, to be honest. I'm going to have to take a dash for the car. Batteries, I want... There we go. Okay. Right, I think we'll drop this off. Get one more stack of uh, metal. Ooh. Hello. I'm sure there is a door here. Any more for any more? Oh. 
Jesus, that made me jump. Right as I saw that bloody puppet round the corner. Ah, we're here. Let's go. Just in case anything comes inside. Oh, yes, give me. Oh, I've been looking for one of those. Yeah, boy. Now we're looking groovy. Crocodile Dundee. This is a film I haven't seen in a long ass time. Very long time. I'm glad I found one of these. I wish it were brown though. That would be best. Green helmet, earmuffs, rubber gloves, and a hobo hat. Alright, let's just quickly skip through this. If there's anything important, I can always get rid of the wheel. What was that? Back there was something. What is that? It's a back bumper from my car. I could put that on. I have a I have I have one of those. I have one of those. Um ba ba bum 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 bum Oh there's another one. Okay, I'm gonna have to come back for the wheel and the bumper. I'm going to have to come back for the wheel and the bumper. Oh, more paint. What's this colour? Light urban. Okay. Don't quite know what colour that is supposed to be. But now that we have two, what we can do, we take brown and we uh, clear the white and we do solid colour. No, I meant to do that. Let's do we do Highlander and then Uh, set first color and then set second why is that all highlighted I can't done already hang on I can't see yep what's it look like I cannot see man show me the gun can't tell if there's any I cannot tell because the colour is too dark. Oh yeah, there is some camo on it, look. Okay, whatever. Looks quite cool. Wouldn't mind getting some lighter reds or... Some candy red would be nice. Yeah, Mr. Candy and all. Would be good. Quickly rummage through this lot. And head back home. Oh, money. Quite a lot of money, 189. Wow. That's not bad. Bad little haul. And that one. Did I do this one? No. Other uh, fuse. Hmm, I have now three of those fuses. Are these individual? No, they're not. And that's full. Okay, right. Let's head back to the car. Drop this off. Get me wheel and me bumper. I think, though, I need the jack to install the bumper. But again, I'm not 100% sure. Ooh, I'm a bit hot. Yes, because I'm carrying all of this weight. Carrying the tyre and the wheel didn't it? wouldn't help. Let's just throw all of this in here. I've got quite a few colours now. got white, urban... Brown and something else. I think. I can't remember what the something else is. I cannot remember what the something else is. You go there. Go there. I don't know if I can install this without the jack. I'll check it. What I do want to do is just... I see you over there. Get a few more of these. If I can... Let's 
skinny one, I gotta be careful. Fast. Mega fast. I just want to fill up the backpack. And then we can skadoosh. Almost done. Okay, we're done. We're done. Right, let's get out of here. See if I can put this on. I'm not sure. And let's head back home and put those units together. Can I install this? Yes, I can. There we go, we've got a rear bumper. Right, put you in there, and let's go. That was a nice little haul. Got quite a lot of... Oh yeah, look at all that scrappy goods. The scrappy goods. Right. Let's head home. Nice little run to the scrapyard. Good place to come for scrap. Because there's a lot of it. There is a lot of it. Ooh, power slide. Right, home is not too far away. Just have to remember the way. Obviously I can't. That's another thing they want to do in the future as well, is they want to um, completely get rid of the map. So in like DayZ, you actually have to find bits of the map and use a compass to navigate your way around. The whole functionality of pressing M will be gone. But also, like in DayZ, that was probably one of the very first mods that most people did, was they installed the map. <laughs> I mean, I do like it, the fact that, you know, you have to find a map, it adds a bit of reali realism to it, which is always good, in my view. But I can see how, for a first-timer, not having a map can be quite difficult. I mean, there are people out there who have been playing Scum religiously, you know, every day. Oh shit, that's not good. That did quite a bit of damage. But I landed it. Um, yeah, who probably can spawn in and go, oh, I know exactly where I am. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. No, I know that there are people who can do that on DayZ, and the DayZ map is. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Probably three times the size of this map, I would say. So yeah, it's all about practice and learning. And that was a nice controlled power slide. Thank you very much. That not 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 so much controlled. Not not so much. Three. Right. Head home. Uh, which way, which way, which way? We go straight over the bridge. That little bridge. Also, uh oh. Also, I know that they've got the plane uh, in Daisy. Oh, uh, sorry, in, in Scum, this game. Uh, getting confused now. But helicopters. Now, there is something w which would be, you know a bit more appealing because you don't have to worry about Ooh. you don't have to worry about uh, a runway as such because you can just take off vertically so a helicopter if they introduced helis mm, I like the sound of that very much so do I like the sound of that. Oh, you again. Hi. How did you not die? I'm going the wrong way, you moron. I thought I was at the other entrance. I need to go around the scary hospital place. And swish. 
Oh, look. Huh. They came out of the woodwork. Yes, such a scary hospital place, that is. Good if you want to get medicine and stuff, as it's a hospital. But it's scary. It's freaky. Gives me the heebie-jeebies. Parking? No, 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 no. It was all planned. It was all planned. Yes, this is where I wanted to be. Now we're in the right way. Look at the draw distance. Look, you can see the um, wind turbines all the way over there. Which is pretty cool. It's pretty cool. All I want to do is get home, put a few boxes together, so I can start sorting out all my stuff. And I think, oh look, we're at 122 fame points now. I can actually buy very limited stuff from the arms dealer. Yay! So I think, once I've put these chests together, not chests actually, they're more storage wardrobes. Once I've put these together, I am going to have to make a little trip true to the trader room to sell some stuff and to purchase very little because 122 fame points basically just unlocks a few magazines and a pistol. <laughs> There's really not much defense! Oh no! Oh no! I have goofed. I have goofed. I'm pretty sure that is going to explode. I do have a repair kit in the car. But I, I honestly don't know if that's going to explode or not. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. I think it's dead to the world. I think it's dead dead. Oh no. Oh damn. Well, I do know where... Th oh no. That's really not good. I need to get my stuff out of there. Because I think... I think that's going to despawn. When I log out, I think that's going to despawn because it's wrecked. Oh dear, oh dear. I don't goofed. I don't goofed. I was doing so well. I was doing so, so well. I really was. Uh, planks. Planks, nails, and rope. I gotta get my valuables out of there. It took so long to find you. I mean, I do know where there are others. So I can use the wheels and the seats, etc. From that one. Uh, where is nails? Take out nail. Take out nail. Now I just need some wire. Uh, 
hopefully that'll be enough. Oh, okay, need more than that. I can't believe I did that. I'm such a fool. There we go. Oh, that's so bad. Actually, I might have to build some more. I may have to build some more. Come on, get in there. Why am I doing it the slow way? I may as well move this to the car. Taking hands, because you can now do this. As long as they're not too heavy, obviously. And you can't run with it either. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Alright, let's get all the valuable things out first. And then we'll worry about the scrap afterwards. But let's just get all of the importanto things out. Oh, I cannot believe I did that. What a goof I am. What a goof. Oh, wow. Is it full already? Oh, damn. I'm going to have to build another one. I'm going to have to build another one. Ah. And things were going so well. Things were going so well. I need some more nails. Take out nails. And I need some more of... Nope. Ooh, can I not? Do I not have any more? Hang on. Uh, the answer to that question is no, I do not. Feed. Okay. Give me a bush, give me a bush, give me a bush. There's a bush. Have to make some tree bark rope. Quickly. I thought you could use barbed wire for, uh... For that stuff. There we go. And I need where is tree bark rope? There we go. Oh no. Well, like I said, I do know where there are two more of those, so Oh. They need more! So I can get one going. Although I'm not sure if they both have engines. I honestly can't remember now. Oh wow, look, my awareness has gone up today, my handgun skills have gone up today, my driving skills have gone up today. Although, my driving skills went up, but clearly... Not very well. Oh, what a donkey. There we go. Taking hands. What a donkey. Right. Give me every... Okay, that's the full one. Give me everything. Oh, man. What a twat. I'm pretty sure this will despawn when I log out. That's why I'm saving all of this stuff. Like the 40 use screwdriver. Only has 20 uses, but still the paint.
Uh, right, now we can just smash in all of this stuff. The good news is, is I actually managed to die, not die, but, you know, ruin the car right where the bike is. So at least I can get around. We still have the bike. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to check now if those vehicles that I found where I used the parts from them to make this one has got an engine. I honestly cannot remember. What a donkey. And I just filled it up with fuel and it's got a full battery. Yeah, I can take the battery out. Right, are we done? Yes, can I open this? Without burning myself? Hot, hot, hot. Can I remove the battery? No, because I don't... Yes, I can. Can I remove the alternator? No. Oh, doody, 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 pooby, pooby. Can I remove the wheels? No, I need the, I need the thing. Remove all the body parts. Right, let's get these out of the way. Uh, let's just put them at the side of the road. Ah, game. Uh, why can I not move you? Hello? Because I have to pick them up. Let's just put them here where I can see them. So they're visible. There we go. One there. And one there. Oh, shit. Oops, wrong button. Not what I wanted to happen. Right. Well, I think that's where I'm going to leave it, on a high slash low. One's the empty one. Yeah, I can't get the wheel in there. I can get the battery in there, though. I can get this in here. Oh, man. My poor car. You know what? It was so hard finding that seat that I'm actually going to... Wow, that's a lot. I'm actually going to hold on to that. It's not too far back home, so I can run home and drop that off. That's okay. And there is a Leica up here. And there is one here. There's two in B3, but I honestly cannot remember if they have engines at all. But guys, that's where I'm going to leave it. Thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, ring that little notification bell so you get notified when my videos go live, and as always, I'll catch you all on...